So you've decided to come and visit Thailand. Well, do you know what it means to be Thai? Or do you know exactly where Thai people come from? This museum has the answers for you. standing in an old building since Rama VI that originally was the Ministry of Commerce but now has been renovated into the Museum of Siam. to the exhibition inside, but how exactly? Well, let's go find out. That intricate design that you saw outside went underground, came out, and came out as this, the white ribbon. This white ribbon represents a road that will take us through the exhibition. So if you want to find out what happens in the exhibition, let's go take that road trip. If you follow this white ribbon, the first place it brings you to is this room, full of these questions. Who inaugurated Bangkok as a capital of Siam? What was sold in a UTS fresh market? What is Thai? Why did the name of our kingdom change from Siam to Thailand? Where was Suvarnabhum? Then leads us into the immersive theater, which we will then learn a brief history of how the kingdom of Siam came to be. Well, it seems like that video was asking us the question. This is the answer to the question. What does it mean to be typically Thai? Well, let's see. The Y, which is a sign of respect. which in English we call spicy papaya salad, a very famous dish that most foreigners know. Thai dancing, tuk-tuks, and Muay Thai. Around circa 150, the landmass that we now live on wasn't quite called the Kingdom of Thailand, but it was known as Suwanapum, which is also the name of our airport, meaning the land of gold. So this entire room tells us a brief history of how that landmass was found, leading us into the next room, answering the question of what makes Thais who they are. Suvanapum are multi-ethnic people, of course, but what actually makes Suvanapum are different things. Bye-bye. Such as the people, 
the city's agricultural and beliefs and religion. When Ayutthaya was finally changed into Bangkok, many people asked if it was a faithful recreation of Ayutthaya. Well, let's see. What Ayutthaya had, Bangkok also tried to maintain. Temple of the Emerald, the Brahmin Temple, Mahachai Fort. Because Ayutthaya was so powerful and modern for its day, Bangkok tried to maintain what Ayutthaya had. The development of the civilized